Hi, I'm Mary Rogers. This is the Cuisinart Compact Juice Extractor. It's really great to make fresh juice right at home. And what you can do is you use the, this little cup here to catch your 16 ounces of fresh juice. And in the back, it has a removable container, and that's where your um, pulp goes. That holds up to 40 ounces of pulp. It has a really large, um, wide mouth here where you put your vegetables or fruits in and it enables you to press this down and that's how your, your uh, fruits or vegetables will get extracted. Um, this lever, when you pull it down, it enables you to open the lid and this is where your basket, which you are, will grind up your food, and your strainer um, is. The machine will not operate if you don't have, the, um, if you don't have it locked in place. So we're going to put the lid back on. It's extremely quiet and really easy to operate. Lock it back in place and that will allow the unit to operate. The on button is right here. All you have to do is turn the unit on. This is very quiet. Lift the feed tube and then we're going to put in our carrot and we're going to start juicing. This in front is also the adjustable lever. This actually will um, control your flow of your juice as you're extracting. So let's go ahead and add some more carrots. Another thing that you can do is if you like this a little bit sweeter, what you can do is you can add an apple or parsley, or you can actually put a little bit of ginger in there and it'll actually make it really, really flavorful. And it's really healthy to juice every day. So go ahead and use your Cuisinart Compact Juice Extractor. The other thing I should mention too is the pulp. Don't throw it away because you can use that in any kind of soup stock or if you're using carrots, you can make carrot muffins with it. What's up guys, today we are going to be unboxing the new and improved, from what I can tell, um, they amped up 
the Knell Masticating Juicer. Still at the $100 price point, which just blows my mind. Um, from what I can tell, they beefed up the plastic. They made it a little stronger. Um, they beefed up the motor. And there is an easy clean strainer in here, which I am super excited about. Here's the box. This company sent me a juicer a year ago and it was my first vertical masticating juicer that I've used. And I just, I fell in love with it. I love the quality of juice that it made. Um, it was just an easy to use machine. It worked really well. I did a 30 day celery juice challenge with it. Um, I made almond milks with it. And all this is on YouTube here. I'll link a bunch of videos below using the previous generation of this juicer. I did a 30 uh, day celery juice challenge and I've juiced a lot of celery. And I think that is why they upgraded a little bit um, with the motor and the plastic strength because so many people uh, jumped on the juicing train last year when celery juice went viral. So here we are. I love this juicer because of its price point. Um, it doesn't require people to spend an arm and a leg to get extremely high quality juice and to get into uh, the juicing scene. It's easy to use um, and it's, just, it's 100 bucks. Like that blows my mind that it's that uh, accessible and easy to use. I hope this is white. It says it's white right here. But I only see silver in like a red-ish, red champagne-ish color um, offered on Amazon. So if you're looking on Amazon and trying to figure out which one is like the new and improved, it'll say Triton. We do have some other fun stuff that we are going to be unboxing on the channel here so stay tuned for those and i'm really excited to see this thing it looks pretty fancy i get hyped over new juicers so let's open it up and see what it looks like that's cool this says if you leave them a review they'll send you a 500 milliliter drinking glass to put your juice in. As far as juicers go, I've been using a um, Breville centrifugal juicer in my Juicing 101 series. If you guys are new here, um, this channel, the we have so much juicing here. My sister and I operate a juicery out of Northwest Ohio if you're into the commercial side of juicing. It has a 10 year warranty now. Dang, the, comp the competition for this juicer is, uh, they're like three, three to $500 juicers so the Hurum easy clean juicer is a 500 500 juicer that they made last year when celery juice it is white oh my gosh i love it uh, the Hurum easy clean juicer is a 500 juicer that um, has the easy clean strainer so this looks like it has the normal strainer that the previous one had And a lot of people would message, um, whether it was this juicer or just a different, um, the ASIC juicer, which is a lot smaller and honestly not even a competitor to this juicer. Um, a lot of people had problems getting their shoots off, so they made the plastic a little bit stronger. That looks a little different. Ooh, look at this little, I'm excited to play with this. It looks so cool. They said they beefed up the motor. 200 watt. I don't see the strain. Is this it? it might be, maybe that's it. It's the auger. Plunger. Every juicer has the same bits and pieces, but look at this. It looks so fresh. It's got a little handle there. Look at this little knob. Man, it looks good. It's the warranty info. As long as you bought it new and uh, you can prove that you bought it, just email them there if you break something. Or Need help with something? That is a mean looking machine. I'm gonna get this cleaned up and then I'll use it a few times and report back with a full review. I just reached out to K now to see if the easy clean strainer 
comes with this. It's advertised on Amazon that it does, so I'm sure that it does. Even if this is just an upgrade to the previous model, I mean, it's awesome. It looks really cool. I can't wait to play with it. I'll keep you guys posted. Definitely stay tuned to the channel. Um, we're gonna dive back into some juicing 101 uh, videos with this guy. So a basic watermelon juice and a basic pineapple juice are up on my uh, list to juice. And if you are new to juicing, definitely check out the uh, playlist link down in the description. There's tons of videos where we go over just all the basics of juicing, um, as well as a mocktail series that we've started. So lots of juicing to come. I can't wait to show you guys this thing in action. It's got an uh, option that says rev. <laughs> I can only imagine what that means. Oh, it's just the reverse. <laughs> I wish <laughs> I wish it had a rev option. All right, let's go get some cucumbers. I love the black and white color scheme because the juice always just pops. It looks so good against the white. This is a project going into the juice shop. Any guesses? Not juice related, but close. It's our next adventure. I had so many fun plans for the garden this year and it just... It rained all of June and was cold. I'm sure you guys had the exact same growing season. These are Punakira cucumbers, which are really pretty. They have this really brown, like, russety look. Let me see if I can find a... a blue box. So pretty. Oh, there's a good one. But I wanted to show you guys um, how easy it was just to grow your own stuff to juice. Like this right here will be a ton of juice. This is why you have a garden. So you can have as much juice as you want. You want to pay for good quality, fresh produce. Just realized that they put little pour spouts on the ends of these, which is awesome. Look at that innovation. You know, it would be really clever if they put how many ounces on here. Fresh produce right off the vine. Oh, I need the funnel. I wrap it up for this video. I'm gonna let this get cold and get this cleaned up. Stay tuned uh, for more info on the Easy Clean Strainer. I'll get you guys posted and up to date on that. And so many more juicing videos to come. Masticating juicers are my favorite. This is as good as it gets. Fresh off the vine, gently processed, yummy, delicious juice. I'm gonna go pop it in the fridge. I'll see you guys on the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye. This is the Breville Juice Fountain Plus, and it's the perfect juicer for those just getting into the juicing lifestyle. It's easy to use, only two settings, high and low. Use low to make the blade spin slower for juicing soft fruits and leafy greens. Use the high speed to cut through tougher foods like apples. This was the first juicer to hit the market sporting a three inch feed tube, so you can juice whole fruits and vegetables. Even dense vegetables such as beets can go in, which are packed with wonderful antioxidants. Really, you can try whatever combinations you happen to have in your fridge, and after the fun element of experimentation, you'll get to know what you like. Celeries, apples, pears and carrots all go well with beets, but to give it a little extra zing, add some ginger root. But go easy on the ginger and build it up as you like the taste because it can overpower your concoction. I tend to try fruit and veggie combinations of whatever is in season. A handy trick is to line your pulp container with a produce plastic bag for an even easier clean up. And Breville juices are easy to clean. You don't need a tool to dismantle it. Simply transfer to the sink Give your parts a rinse and place in the top shelf of your dishwasher. There's an included cleaning brush for your filter basket. I always use this to give my filter a little extra care right after juicing. The Juice Fountain Plus, another great innovation by Breville.